Good morning. Happy Monday. Actually, it's afternoon. It's 12.15 already. Um, I was just going to show real quick what came in the mail today. Another Ally or Ally Express order, however you say it. Um, I just got some gingerbread ribbon. I just thought it was really cute and I plan on doing like a little gingerbread outfit for um, like a little baby. Hopefully, hopefully I can get started on that today. And then I got these little gingerbread resin pieces. And then I ordered more Grinch because I was running low on Grinches and running low on Elmo's. I, these were the things that I was there to buy. <laughs> And then after looking through, I was like, oh, I think I'll order that. So, so that's what came in the mail today. And then I also got some headbands because I was out of red ones. And these blue ones will be good for one of the Shimmer and Shine sets because I'll pair the aqua one. The one I do that's aqua and blue, this dark blue color. So I really didn't have anyone to go with that. And they don't make an aqua headband on... I ordered these from the Hairbow Center. So, I just got six blue, I think a dozen red, six of this bubblegummy pink, six light pink, and six black. Dun -dun -dun! This is where I keep them. <laughs> Among other things that are stashed in this drawer. So, there's an extra glue gun. Here's a necklace. Oh, I think this necklace came... I'm selling, I'm trying to sell, here, I'm going to show you guys. I put this up on my Tool Time Facebook page. This I bought from First Stroll, and I actually bought this two Christmases ago. I thought it was last year, but no. And this is an extra, extra, extra large. And it was supposed to be like a size, either a 7 or an 8. I don't remember what it was listed as. But. Um, I did wash it and then hang it to dry, so it's kind of wrinkly, but, and then it came with a hair bow, and the hair bow, when I got it, it was like rusted, the, like the prongs, but you can still wear it, but it was rusted, and it also came with this necklace, but this necklace was broken, so, yeah, and those came from China, the Ali, Ali Express. I think I paid like, like $17 or $16. So I was trying to sell it for $15 with the hair bow and everything. But nobody's bought it yet. I just want to get my money back out of it. I'm sure this can be fixed if I put something on the end of it. But anyway. Hey guys. Yeah, I look a mess because I am a mess. I've been having such a frustrating day. It just... It's Monday. That's what I can say. It's Monday. It's just... Everything's just been frustrating today. I wanted to go to the post office. I wanted to ship out a Grinch order. And then I noticed that the Grinch onesie actually had some little like marks in it. It was off to the side over here and I think it's actually something that is woven into the fabric. So it made it look like it was dirty. And so I'm like, all right, I'll just remake it. So that's what this is, I remade it. Um, and then I was trying to do a design um, with the So What Pro and every time I moved, it was for Strollin anyway, but every time I moved her name and I would click on all the letters and then I'd move it, it would leave part of the letters behind, like the L and the I, or if I resized it, it would resize everything but the L and the I. Oh my gosh, that made me so mad. I did that for like, I don't know. 30 minutes, 40 minutes, and I was like, okay, I've had enough. Obviously, there's an issue going on with the program. It could have been because I was trying to save a YouTube video. I don't know. So, I was just like, forget about it. So, then I come down here to work, and I have 
uh, two other heat presses that I had to press out besides this one, which are Shimmer and Shine. They're over here. And one is a long sleeve, which is this one, it's in 40. But um, I had a bottle of water down here. And there wasn't very much in it, just a little bit. So I was like, well, I'll fill up the iron. And there was some uh, needles, broken needles. So I filled up the iron with what was left of the water. And I put the broken needles in the bottle. I wanted to put them in the bottle so that, you know, there was a lid on it. And I don't have to worry about them poking anything. And I figured, well, I'll just keep that over there and, you know, put the needles in that bottle. And then when it's full, just, or not full, but, you know, um, throw it away. So I did that. And then I always... Lint roll, lint roll, lint roll, and then um, I put it where I want it to be on the shirt. And then I just kind of go over it with the iron real quickly just so it kind of sets it in place. Not for, you know, anyway, just to set it in place. So when I did that, water spilled out of the iron all over the design. And the design, of course, is a, you know, printed on there. And then... The L leaked pink dye all over the shirt. I'm like, great, great. What else can go wrong? Right, right. So I went ahead and um, printed out a new one. And the other shirt, I was able to get the pink dye out of it. And it's over there and it's drying. I just washed it. And I just ran it under the sink. And luckily it came out. So. So that happened, and then I made some designs with my Cricut, and it was my first Christmas. And I only got a little bit of heat press vinyl, uh, iron-on vinyl. I only had like five little sheets, and I was just going to, you know, play around with some designs, and, you know. So I had one sheet, I think it's like 10 by 10 maybe, of red, gold silver, black, and pink. So I did a My First Christmas with the Red. And I watched plenty of YouTube videos now where I think I'm a pro, but I really am not even close. But um, the one lady was like, um, something if you heat it up first, heat your vinyl up a little bit um, with a, your heat press or whatever, um, that they peel off real easy. So I was like, okay. So I stuck it on there. It wasn't even very, I mean, it was like one second, two seconds, I don't know. Here is one that has, uh, or that had, this is my snowflakes. So when I try to peel it off, it won't peel it off. I mean, it's all, it's like, like I can't see where the snowflake is anymore. <laughs> what? I don't know. I know they're on there. I know I printed them on, printed it. There was one of them right there. It's all messed up. But anyway. Yeah. I went upstairs and I printed them off again. And then when I did, I clicked the mirror button, but it didn't print off mirrored. So, there. I'm ruined too. So, finally, I went up and I was able to print off a couple more. And I got them done. And here they are. This one is my favorite because I just love the way it sparkles. And then I did it also in gold. But there's a little piece right there. It won't focus on it. But there it is. There it is. You can see it. I can just pick that off, I hope. But anyway, I think these are super cute. Yay! But that's how my night's going. How's your night going? Well, we printed off Miranda pictures and they were black and white. Yeah. I drew a picture. Yeah. Well, alright. Look out. Mm -hmm. So what happened? Redid it. Yeah. 
think she looks better than this one. Yeah. Because because her eyes look are too small for the mask, and these is just perfect. Good job. So here is my gingerbread girl. I finally finished it. This is, um, I forgot this fabric. What is it called? It's right here. It's like a flannel. That's what it is. It's a brown flannel, so it's really, like, soft. But I couldn't decide on what color to use for the gingerbread girl. I wanted it to go with the ribbon. And so I used red. So it had a lot of red, and then I wanted green, so I go with my ribbon, yeah. I think it's cute. I think if I do another one, I might do with a different, a lighter, because I was tossing up between, here it is, this, which is like a tan, I don't know, but then it wouldn't have went with that. I don't know. And then at first I had glitter. Um, brown out, but I didn't think it'd look right with glittery brown. Plus, I wanted the dress in glitter. I think she's cute, don't you, Sterly? Yeah. Yeah. It is now 11:36. I'm upstairs. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and head to bed. I I'm not gonna package anything up because I'll probably take it. Ooh, take it to the post office tomorrow, so. Turned out so cute. I like the sparkles. And I think it'll look really cute. I didn't look at the resins. Where are all the resins? Here's the little resins. It's a little, I don't know, it'll show up once to focus on my face. Now turn it maybe. Maybe that will work. There's one. So she's got a little red bow. Button. Anyway. Hopefully that is something. Hopefully that is something I can get finished here in the next couple days and get a picture of it. I really don't know what I'm going to do for the tutu yet. But if I did a ribbon trim, like did it pink with red and green? Or did it red with, I don't know, pink? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. We'll see what I come up with. But yeah, that, um, I still, there's one up there. You see that one? I still gotta take pictures of that. I haven't even taken pictures, but I have listed it as just a onesie in my Etsy shop, so. Anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog. I know I didn't vlog very much today. It's because we didn't go anywhere or do anything other than schoolwork. Anyway, I will see you guys tomorrow. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Bye! Don't forget to send us a Christmas card and we'll send you one back. Merry, Merry Christmas! Christmas!